everyone, in this episode of Race Max Direct Tech, we are taking a look at roller lifters. Now we all know that a roller lifter has less wear, less friction and better properties than a flat tappet style lifter, which means you can generally run a more aggressive camshaft profile uh, as it helps make the lifter run over the camshaft lobe a lot better. But the big question when it comes to a roller lifter is hydraulic versus solid. Now obviously hydraulic lifters are better for clearance and better for long term engine servicing, but the biggest problem with hydraulic lifter is you get the pump up in the lifter, uh, which can cause an unstable valve train and can also mean that your actual lift is less than your predicted measured lift. So a solid lifter will give you more horsepower. Now one of the leading roller lifter manufacturers is BAM Roller Lifters in the USA. They've got years of experience and they only make roller lifters and then they supply them direct to engine builders. Now their lifters are triple alloy billet steel and the 3D CNC programming removes all of the sharp edges and makes it smoother, which is obviously good for moving inside the lifter bore. They've got a rigid four column design, they're heat treated for maximum strength, they've got the high strength tie bars, they've got a nitrided bearing steel axle and they have pressure fed oiling. They are pretty much the standard when it comes to a roller lifter. They have needle roller bearing for street and performance, but as spring pressure, camshaft aggressiveness and boost pressure rise, the load on the needle bearing can cause distortion, which can lead to failure, and then you get the needles going through your engine and causing even more damage. So it is recommended to upgrade to a bush bearing. Increased surface area of the bush means it can absorb more impact when there's valve float or any other type of valve train instability or shock loading like when using the two-step. There is a bronze bush for racing and performance and then a solid steel DLC or diamond-like coating for extreme racing applications. There is a bunch of different combinations for different engines such as Ford, Chevy, Holden and Chrysler. For more information and the complete range, contact the guys at RaceMax Direct.